Our first order is actually a $10 plus four item shop and pay, and I'm paying cash for it. I haven't figured out how to use my Apple card, and I've also learned to like ask the staff there to help me find this shit. All right, so let's go. We're going to CVS right down the street. All right, we're going right up here. We're gonna actually tie up really easily. I think I'm gonna tie up my helmet to the vehicle. I don't wanna bring it in. How you doing? I'm picking up an Uber Eats order. Maybe some staff can help me. It's the first thing is for batteries. I know I'm gonna need help getting that. Uh, the panic is on. Now I gotta figure out like which battery. This should be easy. A double A four pack, no problem. That's cool. Thank you, thank you. I'll be so next one is seven three. and three. Okay, three is closest. Thank yeah. you, thank you. Three. Soft soap, liquid. Soft soap is a brand. Okay, there it is. Oh my God. There's no more aloe vera left. There's no more aloe vera. There's some milk and honey. This is the aloe vera, C-A-L-V-R. And there's only like this cucumber melon in the back. So the soft soap, yeah, they're out of it. So I'm gonna get, I guess I'll get like the milk and honey. I guess I'll get a substitute, I guess. I'll call the customer. And three energy drinks. Pass Hello. seven. Hey there, it's your Uber driver. So I'm looking through the soft soap. They're actually out of aloe vera. I can see the empty column. Can I entice you with milk and honey uh, flavor instead of the same brand? Awesome, okay, thank you. Oh, there it is, zero ultra energy, the white. Just, why don't you just say the white? 3.39 each, okay, I gotcha. Where can I pay cash? Because I'm gonna pay cash. Okay, thank you. Place your item in the bagging area. I'm All right, 2321, we got every item. We called about the substitution, and now we only gotta go 0.6 miles for 10 bucks. That's why we had to take this order. Easy. But I lost the glove, but there it is. Is it crazy that I'm paying with my own money? I feel like it's, it makes it shit easier, to be honest with you. So, all right, let's get out of here. Oh, I haven't seen an Irby for a long time. Pretty cool, that was my very first scooter. Oh, yeah, that's the, uh, that's not the, I had the Pro GT. Look at what I'm up to now. Shut up, you caught me. I almost left my glasses there. Yeah. Very cool, man. How long have you had it for? Say it again. What are you getting in uh, MPAs today? This gets 50, 55 miles an hour. This thing is crazy. Yeah, 15. <laughs> but yeah, no, I rode one for my, I bought my first scooter was an Irby Pro GT. It's a sick model. Sounds good, man. Josh, Josh, what I want to fix that for you. That'll be fucking cool. I want to see it. Uh, All right, boy, take it easy. Yeah. I got real excited about seeing that scooter because that literally was the first scooter I ever bought. I bought a, like the model up from that, but still a very similar Irby Pro. I had the Pro GT. It was a very fucking cool scooter. It was an amazing folding mechanism. Hopefully I caught a good video of that. Uh, that company I think is actually debunked. I know their store is not in, or oh, trying to make a left here on the long prey. Oh, okay, watch this move. Hold on, nobody get hit here. Let's go. But anyhow, uh, this, let me just get to closer to the destination, focus on driving. Oh, it's right here, okay. In apartment 220, I can go? Yeah. Thank you. A place like this, I can just leave this here. I can leave this here for a second, ma'am? You're the best, thank you. You got stairs? Stairs? Uh, Stairs? Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy. Have a lovely day. You too. All right, so that's our first order down. We've been out here for 26 minutes. Not too bad for 10 bucks. All right, buddy. Well, I do appreciate your help. Uh, question is, why do we got to have this fucking soda machine here, man? I, yeah. I don't need a soda right now, but I could drink one. 
Uh, yeah. They got the old school price here too, a dollar. All right, thanks again, man. See you next time. All right, that was good. We're done. I guess I don't mind shopping pays that much. All right, let's go. You know, it's funny, I didn't even realize that we were like right on top of Chick-fil-A, so I guess that's where we're going. Oh, it's so nice out, love the sun. There's a guy on a scooter. It's just a regular guy. 55, man. That's yeah. Nasty, man. Take it easy, bro. Everybody's asking me about the speed of the scooter today. Uh, all right, guys, we have a long range, three mile order. It's for 10 bucks, it's from Roro's. And uh, DoorDash has a $3 promotion on it, so it's really a $7 order with a $3 little extra. It's pretty rare that DoorDash is given some extra money, but Ro oh, we went the wrong way. <laughs> Roro's is an easy place to pick up from. Actually, we can turn up here. Roro's is an easy place to pick up from. They'll be ready, uh, most likely, and then we got a long ride, but we can go there at a pretty fast speed. So let's go get this Roro's, our second $10 order in a row. We like that idea. There was a chicken place on every corner around here. There was this place, Roro's. This was like the only place to go. This place is the best, or one of the best. Well, hopefully they'll be okay here. Hello. How you doing, man? I got a DoorDash for Evan P. Thank you, brother. Checking on the scooter as my strap fell off here. I gotta put this back on. I don't wanna leave the scooter unattended too long in this crazy part of town. All right, we got a three mile ride. So we're going to North Wilton and even, even though that address is north, we're actually just heading like pure south. So, all right, 2.8 miles. Nice little $10 order though. We will take it, let's go. That's 45. I saw a big open lane in front of me, so let's do 45. Let's do the rest of this trip for safety at 35, guys. 35 is safe, 45. Safe less. Man, we already went pretty far and we still got a mile and a half to go. I'll say it again. Three miles on a scooter is fucking pretty far. The entire southbound route on Vine, which I'm supposed to go a half a mile down, is closed it looks like here. I mean, how long is this gonna be closed for? But we're gonna sidewalk it. I hope we don't have to sidewalk it for a half a mile. Uh, I think we're coming to the end of it right here. Now we can just shoot across and go straight and fast. Minutes, 48 seconds to All right, we're close. It's on the left somewhere. Damn, we had to stand there a long time just to do this. Boom. Oh. Easy peasy. We're pretty far from home though. Pretty long ride back now. We'll just take Beverly and we'll just go uh, Beverly to Chick-fil-A basically, <laughs> a long way. All right, so we're following Rudy now. I think we're going back to Chick-fil-A though would be my guess. Oh, there's scooters everywhere. Scooter there. Oh, Rudy. Rudy's got the slack box style. He's a good rider. Now we don't wait for slow bikes either. All right, was this, which way do you want to go? Let's go, all right, let's go to Chick-fil-A. I'm going back in first gear. We're wasting battery doing this. Always drive top speed? No, always. So okay, you got it in two. That's good, that's good. That was great getting a shot with Rudy on the road with me. Uh, I told him to go to Chick-fil-A, not to wait for me, so, but I'm gonna be, we're, we're still gotta get there. Oh, we're getting stuck at every fucking stop sign and light here. You got an order, you fucker? Yeah. Oh my God, you got it here faster than me. All right, I'm sitting, I'm gonna get a 10. <laughs> we picked up a $4 shorty. Delicia Y, I think that's it. Delilah, close enough. Thank you, sir. See you next time, ma'am. Okay, guys, a little easy $4 order. We're happy to be on the road. It's warm out here. We actually had to take our hoodie off. It's nice, though. 
Uh, we're going over to Vine, 1513. I'm not familiar with the address, but I know the direction and I think it's like an easy meet at the door. I hope it is. Since we're not making much money on it, let's get it done quick. We know it's going to be on this side of the street, so we might as well just jump over here. Uh, 1513 should be really close. No numbers. This is, oh, there it is, here it is, here it is. Okay, we got it, we got it. <laughs> Hi guys, for Delicia. How you doing? Pretty good, pretty good. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much, see you next time. While I was doing that, I got a $7.75 like two mile order from DoorDash I wanted to grab from El Pollo Loco. I've never done a delivery from there. I haven't eaten there in a long time either, but apparently there's a, uh, it's okay, buddy, excuse me. Apparently there's a, uh, God, this is terrible out here today. I guess there's an El Pollo Loco down here. We've got a little mini ramp here and we're gonna probably bring it in here if I had to guess. Well, I, could put, I could leave it right here actually, this is fine. How you doing El Pollo Loco? I got a, Hi there, I got a Otis F for DoorDash. Beautiful. Is there a drink? No. Okay, thank you. All right, let's go. No drink. I was prepared for a drink, kids, but no drink. Let's go. We're going to Martell. We're actually got to turn around and head north. It's not too far from here. Whoa. No drinks. Let's fucking blast it. You got it, baby. This is it. I believe we have a code. Beautiful. Oops, sorry, door. All right, so. Damn. One, four, four, seven and a half. All right, easy enough. We got a McDonald's order behind us, so we kind of kind of jog a little bit. Five dollar point seven mile. McDonald's on top of this, let's go. You can probably tell I'm not getting much B-roll because we're just going job to job, so I don't have a chance to do that. I usually do that while I'm waiting for jobs, so. All right, let's go to McDonald's on La Brea. What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? What are you doing? Asshole. Feels like we have not done an order from this, this McDonald's since we've returned. I don't think we have. We ate here the other day, though, I know that. Uh, but we should walk right in on this one because it did take us a second to get here. Just a little $5 order should be pretty easy. Oh, why do they look so busy in there? I don't know. And there's some old person here trying to open this door. Oh, let me help you. Let me help you. Thank you. Of course, of course, of course. I got it. Thank you, ma'am. I got it. I didn't get a code or a receipt. 99C are the last three for Uber. 99C. Thank you. Thank you. God, that was such fucking bullshit. She, she called the fucking number and then that guy just fucking cut in. Oh, there's cheese on my fucking burgers. Jesus Christ. That was a classic, insane McDonald's. I don't know why it was so crazy in there. All right, where are we going to now? 821. Fuck. Turn right on North LaGrea. Little stores right here. I think it's got to be this right here. It's 825. So, is this 821 right here? Oh, I don't know. That's a question. Well, let's see if this is 821. If this is not 821, then we'll know that is. That's 813. That's 15. Oh, so that's got to be 21. Is this 821? This is 821, correct? I have a DoorDash uh, Uber for Andrea H. Oh, this is not 821. Okay, I got you. Thank you, buddy. I'll figure it out. All right, well, this is 25. This is 825. It's La Brea, right? I mean, we're in the right fucking spot, right? Um, hey there. I'm glad you waved. I figured it's you. Are you in the thrift shop? Yeah, I'm in the thrift shop. Jeff. No, they, they gave me 821. I, I thought... I thought they might have just might have the wrong address or something, but it's no big deal. We got you a fresh new McDonald's here for you. Thank you very much. Enjoy. All right, thank you. Thank you. 
that order was nothing but a huge pain in the ass you know i picked up a three dollar uber chipotle and the reason why i'm taking them is because prop prop 22 will fill out the time these uber orders are really paying off to work at this spot all the time it's crazy it's been so long since we've been here should it bother me that i'm like sitting in the same spot francisco is sitting while he waits for his order I got a Alex and Alex. Thanks, dude. 435, we're going to some furniture shop right down the bread. Should be pretty easy. 435. Seriously, at this fucking huge place? You're not my Chipotle customer, are you? Alex? Yes, sir, you got it. How's business? Thank you. Okay, thank you. It's insane out here, what is going on? Let's do 15 minutes at Target before we think about going to Chick-fil-A. Feels like we, we did get a couple orders around here, it feels like. I was actually seriously shocked when I got this order. 1.3 miles, $11.50, and we finally get to go back to Mendocino Farms for the first time since we've made our comeback. All right, looks like an easy order. Let's go. There's usually not this many people. I don't remember there, there being this many people out here. I guess everybody wants to go out in the nice weather for food instead of uh, ordering delivery, but this is a great order. Eleven fifty for 1.3. It's been a while since we've gotten one of these. I, lo I love when I walk in and I can see mine right there. Catherine M., thank you very much. All right, hell yeah, hell yeah, guys. We got it, no problem. Let's go. I think this should be an easy order. We're going over to Fairfax, 1.3 miles, no biggie. Amazing order, $11, like back in the day. Are you my Mendocino Farms customer? Yep. All right, how you doing? Good, how are you? Pretty good, pretty good. Everybody loves Mendocino Farms. I got, I've got a million deliveries from them. There you go, fresh, thank you. Enjoy. You too. We're stuck in traffic here. We're trying to go south and make a left. Well, we got an order at Target, so we're going to go back to Target. Let's take a seat at Target somewhere. Oh my God, why are there so many people out here? It's crazy. I gave him a chance here at Target. We just didn't get an order. So we're going to take this north to Chick-fil-A. I want to get in over here though. Come on, let me in, let me in, let me in. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I want to go make a left here. I want to go north. What is this? 11.75 for three miles for a from fucking Tartine. Let's fucking do it. It's gonna be a schlep though. It's gonna be far, but we're doing it. Be far. I always say if I don't know the name of the street, it's far. It's on Plymouth. I have no idea what that is. Wow, they're so busy. I, yeah, I do have Mark. Yeah, that's nice. Nice. I know he's got a coffee. I'm sure I got to wait for that, right? Okay, no problem. The coffee, okay. I'll come back. With, okay, I got you. Of course. All right, so we're going to throw this in our box and go back and get the coffee. All right, thanks, dude. We'll see you next time. Awesome. Thank you. Man, they spent so much time. All they had to do was fucking pour this. Ridiculous. Whatever. See you, bud. Two point eight miles for this order. It's gonna be a bitch. We did pack the coffee nice and tight, though. 
Come on, people. Fuck. Fuck. I didn't mean to go straight. I wanted to turn. We're basically flying down Beverly on this order. It's really far. I think the turn is on Rossmore. Yeah, it's up here. Wow, we're all the way down here on six. This is far. Where are we going now? Right on a Plymouth and I have it. 606. It's actually, this is it right here, boom. I'm having trouble getting this uh, ring bell, so I know it's here. Hand it to me, 606. That's what this is, 606, right? Oh, am I in the wrong spot? Maybe this is, it might be 608. Oh, am I in the right spot? Oh, 606, okay. Well, I just wasn't sure. Thank you, thank you. That worked out pretty good. Now I guess we gotta go home, or at least back to the center. We've been out here for over three hours or over 20 miles for sure. Plenty of range left. I think I'm gonna sit and wait for one more order and then we'll probably call it a day. Yeah. Friends, we sat here for like 15 minutes, did not get a finishing order, so we're just gonna call it a day. Let's go home and I will wrap it up for you. Man, it actually got really warm out here. I'm happy about that for sure. Better warm than fucking cold. Fellow pioneers, we are done. Thank you for joining me for another shift. Since this is the end of my work day, I'm gonna post the numbers for yesterday's shift and today's shift. I think we might have actually broken 100 bucks in like under six hours. I mean, that's not a lot of money, it's not bad. I'll say at $15 an hour, this job sucks. At $20 an hour, it's okay. At 25 an hour, it's great. Anyhow, guys, make sure you use my bonus code, Electric Scooter Academy, if you're buying any E-Move or Cabo product from Vora Motors. Every time you do that, you really help me out as a content creator. There's not really a lot of money in the YouTube ads, you know. So uh, that affiliate deal with Vora Motors really goes a long way. Otherwise, you can help me out by subscribing to the channel, liking the video, leaving comments, asking questions. Okay, kids, that's it. Let's go home, these dogs gotta be walked. Get the fuck out of bed, bitch, go. Get up, get up, get the guy, go up.